And Krag, I mean, having some decent ways to clear smoke, but not none that come without the risk of just getting punished hard by Forest Baron. And I wonder, I'm very, I have no idea what the hell this matchup's going to look like, so I guess we'll both be finding out. But these are some of the classic characters. This is some of the most studied matchups we have in Rivals. I haven't been around that long. <laughs> Me either. But we're going to be getting into it. Uh, game one going to be on Ethereal Gates, or whatever the hell this alt skin is called. We're seeing already a lot of very patient gameplay from both players. I think they're scared of how much damage you can convert off of a hit here, but... I feel like that's true for both of them. I mean, let's be real. That's every character in this game. I feel like these two especially are just like, you DI one thing wrong, you're taking 80 or dying. Yeah, and they can both put up such good defensive walls with Puddle and Rock. Yeah, so, this is going to be a turf war for sure. Absolutely. Right, well, stage control is going to be the most important thing that they can uh, do for right now. Could he be missing that wavelength on the stage? I like that recovery, kind of what he had to do. And keeping it very even so far uh, is Bicycle. Uh, very much so the underdog in this set. MSB, a well-established top player. That crag is a, Ooh. that is a storied crag. Bicycle looking for a bit of an edge guard here. There's a puddle on the pillar, but not going to look like it's going to amount to anything. Well, no, he needed an up air there. Maybe he thought he was going to drop through the platform. But I feel like up air would have caught that anyways. Like, I feel like uh, MSB did not fall fast enough where an up air would not have caught that. Maybe it wouldn't have killed, but it's Orcane up air at 155. I feel like that would have killed Ooh, back nice air. back air. Going to be taking it anyways. <laughs> nice back air. I'm going to say it. I don't care. <laughs> Bicycle catching MSB holding rock hold on. <gasps> Crazy Ooh. edge guard. Oh, but MSB is gonna make it back. The Orca Hop not gonna be able to find the the uh, forward air back to stage. You just keep on trading. Crazy all stage shenanigans and, and there's the gimp. Bicycle, what a statement with that edge guard. Making big moves. But that's a different tournament. We don't talk about old. Uh, anyways. Bicycle just taking what was looking like an even, maybe slightly MSB leaning game and turning it into one of the most explosive edge guards I've ever seen. What nice a parry! parry! Did not get to that punish in time. Let's see how much he can push this uh, stock advantage. Because Craig can definitely take him quick. And just the awareness in these scrapping situations to get those parries, and we are seeing a full stock lead. Bicycle just he has percent. MSP's number right now. There's, there's the border. border. <laughs> We're going Ooh. to last stock. And Craig, not a character to be trifled with in last stock situations, can pile up a lot of damage very quickly, very difficult to kill. I like that recovery route from MSB, taking advantage of the bubbles there even from Bicycle. And Bicycle, I mean, this is, what is this Seven. thing? Not for a swing of momentum, going to DI down, looking for the pillar, not going to be able to find it, and the down strong Bicycle. Very nice first game. The Orcane that could is taking game one. Sweatshirt's coming off from MSB, bro is locked in. Nodding his head. He got that. Knows it was close. Maybe he's maybe MSB is running low on granola bars. Honestly? You should go ask him. Mm, that would be interference from the commentary. <laughs> I feel like that was such a good opportunity to say that'd be mid-set coaching. <laughs> exactly, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> This would be such a good opportunity for like a Snickers ad read. You're not you when you're hungry. Eat a granola bar. <laughs> yeah. Eat a granola bar. If you want us to say a brand, pay us. There you go. You got our, our ad reel right there. Mm -hmm. uh, but I'll anyways. Chill. I'm not above it. Uh, game two. Down there. Down strong. MSB bursting out of the gate here with a ton of damage on the bicycle. And I feel like this is kind of what we were seeing last game. Like this just, this just happens. It's been such a swingy matchup. Because I feel like both of these characters are like impenetrable fortresses in the advantage state in their own little ways, and you do not want to get caught holding that rock. 
Bubbles going to be doing a very significant amount of damage. Ford Air going to be taking it. Bicycle going to be dropping the first stock. MSB going to have to look to pile on a bit of a lead here if last game was any semblance of that. Uh, Bicycle is somebody who's going to need a bit of a bit of breathing room again, so to speak. Bicycle being, or playing dangerous game at ledge here. There's the parry. The down tilt sent it up, looking for the up air conversion. I love the ingenuity off that. <gasps> Rock toss into neutral air. Ooh, down strong. Very nice conversion catching. Only half the rock takes that stock. And you know, I I guess this just crossed my mind, and I mean, it seems like uh, Orcane's been old reliable for bicycle, but if things get too hard for the little Orca, it is that Forest Baron in the back pocket. Well, we uh, was it right now since he has game one. This is already the Orca that could. He may be down right now, but we saw him turning back the first game. He can definitely do it this one. One thing that I really want to like draw attention Ooh, to. Holy nice. shit, what a conversion from Bicycle. The one thing I really want to draw attention to from Bicycle is just his awareness of parry timings and scramble situations. Like, he's using these like aggressive parries so, so well, and just his reaction time is unbelievable oh, in that, that. regard. They're kind of on cue, right? Like, we're already seeing it. I must be having a hard time getting back to stage with all this pressure coming from Bicycle. Bicycle very much at home uh, applying this pressure. I was wondering if we were going to see a Hydro Plant up strong. <gasps> down strong going to extend, or the Rock going to extend the Hurt Box of the Down Strong. Bicycle looking incredible right now. MSB going to get a little bit of stage back with the parry. parry. Forward Strong not quite going to take it. Slow recovery. With the rock, and that is game two for Bicycle. What is happening? The little orca that could. Bicycle is just not letting up. This is incredible orcane play we're seeing right now. Bro is feeling himself. You could see it in the head nod. Mm -hmm. He is locked in. Up two to zero right now against MSB. He is feeling himself. This this is some impressive orcane play. Carrying MDVA on his back right now. Got that hometown advantage. Interested in the state. God, this his parries are just so, so good. His momentum carrying straight through from the last game. Already getting these really nice parries. Three, three of them, three of them in and the first 20 seconds of the game. Like, if uh, an MSB situation, how, what is he thinking? How does how do you get around someone who's pairing everything you do? I feel like at that point, you just have to, like, take a step back and breathe. Like, you're trying to scrap too much, and just, you've got to be careful where you're throwing out buttons. Because not only is Bicycle getting these parries, but the reward he's getting off of them is crazy. Mm -hmm. Right now, it's looking fairly even, though. For sure, I mean... We've been drawing all the attention to Bicycle. MSB kind of silently just just keeping in it on his own. Mm -hmm. Back air, not quite going to kill. Crag is one fat beetle. MSB sturdy like a rock, putting in the work, putting in the damage, but take Love that mix. it. Bicycle with the down strong. Bicycle not going to be rushing, taking the stock there, and will be rewarded for it. Extra credit coming out. Go to extra credit, Roll. <laughs> And the Ooh, rock snipe. Rock snipe. MSB staying in it. And I love that he's not letting bicycle like momentum get to him. Like he's still scrapping. He's still staying in it. Knows he's got to lock in, but I mean, he's just kind of abusing Crag's survivability really, really well. And I'm hoping to see a little bit more of that. We saw lucky oh one, but goodness. down air to up strong and bicycle. Looking to make a resounding 3-0. Are we going to see a quick 30 and a handshake from this set? Not at all what I was expecting. Me either. This is looking very one-sided for Bicycle right now. Double down tilt in the back air. Knows he's going to be looking for that air dodge extension. For someone who can make a pillar, or, uh, MSB's having a hard time finding solid ground to stand on. 
That needs to be an up air. I think it would have hit. I'm, I wonder if that back air was a misinput or if there was just some weird, weird DI mix up he's going to go for. I feel like MSB needs to take the stock and he needs to take it now. But still, already in the la uh, the ledge situation after just being uh, the one putting on the pressure. It's already there. It is. Bicycle 3-0-ing MSB going on to top eight. Con 